The Rainbow Six team has finally released a video regarding one of the two new defenders coming to Rainbow Six Siege during Operation Parabellum. The video they released just a few hours ago is for the Defender Alibi, and whether you've seen the video or not, it will be playing up on screen every once in a while, and we're going to dive a little bit deeper and discuss who Alibi is and what her gadget really means for the meta of the game. Now, obviously, every Operator release changes the meta in some sort of a way, some more than others, and Alibi seems to be shaping up to change the meta pretty drastically. As seen in the video, Alibi can deploy holographic projections of herself during a round. Now, we remain to see how this actually is active in the game, uh, but based on the video, we can kind of speculate a few things. It looks like she's going to be able to deploy two holographic versions of herself, whether they, they can be deployed simultaneously or just one at a time or even their active duration again remains to be seen but in the video these holographic copies of herself look exactly like her we don't know if they behave like her or what but regardless they look like her so operators on the attacking side will see one probably think it's her and shoot it and if she's nearby she can see where these uh, attacking operators are and get to jump on them because they think they're killing the real version of alibi now again, we don't know how these holograms actually behave, we don't know if they're going to stand stationary like they did in the video, or if they're actually going to try to mimic the actions of the real alibi in-game. I think that if these holographic versions of herself didn't move and they just stood stationary staring in one direction, I don't think that would really change the meta way too much, because a lot of players when playing Siege are moving around constantly, they're leaning or they're going prone, they're running around, they're doing something, so having holographic versions of of a character and having them do absolutely nothing I don't think that would impact the game too much as most people would learn okay that's just a fake version I'm not gonna shoot that I'm not gonna give my location away but regardless we'll be seeing how she actually plays in game on the 20th during the live stream of the pro league I'm really excited to see how alibi actually plays in game um, I really am excited to use her. I think these holograms are going to be a good addition to the game if they are implemented correctly. Now we're going to dive a little bit deeper again and read her bio that was released on the Rainbow Six website. My apologies if I butcher some of the pronunciations in these things. Uh, I'm not the best at reading things, but let's go right ahead and read this. Picking Alibi is an invitation for battle of wits with your opponents. This defender is all about finding clever ways to force the attacker's hands. Any hesitation comes at a heavy price. The character of Alibi was inspired by undercover infiltration specialists in the Italian Ruggipimento Operativo Special Unit. She is a cunning woman with a gift of infiltrating defense networks of organized crime. Her name is Aria De Luca. She was born in Tripoli, Libya and immigrated with her family when she was only three years old. Her father managed a small ordnance manufacturer, using his contacts to open up exports. DeLuca earned her understanding of Italian firearms through the family business and training on the shooting range. At 18, Arya entered the European Championships and won gold in two divisions. Following the event, a recruiter convinced her to join the police force. DeLuca's precision shooting skills shot her up the ranks, and she served for a time with the elite uh, Rugpimento Operativo Special in fighting organized crime. She eventually earned a spot in the GIS and following a successful operation in Afghanistan, despite being separated from her unit, she was signed out for undercover work in organized crime. She infiltrated the Viguera crime family and spent several years among them before bringing them down from the inside. Now, again, apologies for uh, butchering some of the pronunciations of the names and whatnot. I'm not the best at reading those things offhand, but we could gain a little bit of understanding of who this new uh, operator alibi is. While the bio is never really there to serve as a here's what their gadget is, here's what they do, it gives us a nice little lore and a little bit of backstory as to who she is and uh, how she came about. Again, I'm really excited to see how this operator is going to work and play out in the game. We'll be seeing a little bit more during the live stream to see how this gadget actually works. Let me know what you think in the comments down below and if you're excited to see Alibi in action. Thank you guys for sticking around and watching this video, and I will see you guys in the next one. Cheerio, mates!